Hi, how are you? It's Traps here, and welcome back to our adventures in Azeroth. Last episode, we did a battleground, Warsong Gulch. And at the end of it, we leveled up. We got to level 60. Surprised that we actually got XP from it. But I guess that's a new thing in Wrath of the Lich King. And today, we are back in Hellfire Peninsula. And we will be continuing our journey through the Burning Crusade. We're going to go over here and turn in the quest, Know Your Enemy. Can I help you? Greetings, Trapbox. My fellow sons of Lothar and I have been stuck on this miserable world for close to 20 years now. We held on as best as we could, but it still amazes me that the threats we face today are just the shadows of our past failures. Perhaps... Oh. You will help us atone for them. Know your enemy. Lieutenant Amadi nods. Good. We need all the help we can get. The increasing fellow orc presence around the southern rampart concerns me. I sent out a scout to investigate, but he hasn't yet returned. Fellow orc scavengers. Scavengers, orcs of the Bone Chewer clan, skulk about the ruined battlements overlooking the path of glory. We must assume that these fell orcs are gathering war machine parts for their masters within Hellfire Citadel. They must be stopped. Find Borchier orcs to the north, trap box. Find them and slay them. But use caution. For although these orcs are the lesser of the fell orc clans, their strength is the match of any green skinned orc we've faced thus far. Alright, so we're going to slay some bone chewer orcs. Doesn't look like we can use any of the stuff that she's going to give us. Just too Have bad. A good one. And there's a couple more quests here. I guess we'll pick those up too. Why not? How are you? Sons of Lothar have been fighting a war without end. I'm amazed we've kept our equipment in as good shape as it is. Waste not, want not. Reinforcements are great, but I don't see him hauling any wagons loaded with ingots or timber. Take a look around, friend. Trees are in short supply and the mines are overrun with legion scum. I'm in a bad way for supplies, and I'm making what substitutions I can, but it's time to start reusing what we can. The southern edge of the Path of Glory is stone with the ruins of siege machinery. Some pieces of them are still unusable, kneeling up to a bit of old savage operation. All right, so we'll do that. I don't think we'll be replacing... Maybe we'll... Yeah, we're actually going to replace these legs, I think. Off with you. Do we have any other quests here? I think that's it. Alright, so let's go deal with the Bone Chewer Orcs. And we'll uh, pick up these... Pieces of wood and metal here. It's got a BOE. Not bad. It's got a crit. DKs do a lot of damage. Oh, we've got a rogue on us. What level is that guy? He's got to be 70. That was hilarious. Hilarious. Well, that's Grobulus, guys. We're getting ganked by rogues. I'm like, there's no way that guy's around my level. Yeah, we're gonna get creeped quite a bit, I think. While we're out in that land. That guy's just killing all the DKs. Okay, so let's bandage up. I wonder if he'll leave us alone.
What already did to us? Her combat log? What happened to me? Doesn't even tell me that guy's name? Yeah, there he is. He eviscerated me. For 903 damage. Bunch of poison. Sinister Strike. Crit. For almost 2k. Yeah, that was big damage there. Oh, great. This guy again? Oh, he's helping us out this time. Is that the same guy? No, it's a new one. 65 on Dead Rogue. I wonder if this guy's like looking to fight me. Probably is. He's helping me out. What a nice guy. Is that how the horde are on this server? There's so many horde rogues around here. <laughs> They're all undead. But he's earthing out. Oh, we got a caster on us. I guess just strangulate that guy. Go strangulate this guy. We actually need to get a reagent. Some of the cool. Still haven't figured out how to do that. Or where to buy the corpse dust. Oh, so you need to use you can use a humanoid corpse. I didn't know that. Well there we go. How many can you have? Oh. Wonder if you can can control the pet, like kind of like a hunter. Maybe. We got a pig on us. This guy just keeps parrying us. Let's bandage up again. Oh, they don't last that long either. So we need wood and metal. Some metal over there. The effect from mine freeze looks pretty cool. Looks like they came out of the freezer. Oh, we got another one. Seems a little bit of, uh. A bit of blood boil there.
Where do we get there? A turning knife of the elder. Another dagger. Alright, so we should be done with the wood after this. Now we just need to get some metal. I remember when TBC first came out on Feralina, this place was littered with players. Like the Alliance were all on this side, the Horde were all on the other side. Tons of PvP going on. Is that metal too? Yep. Yeah. Got a pallet in there. What a... Is he trying to get that metal? Gotta beat him to it. Looks like I pulled like so many. Look at how he's doing. Seems to be doing all right. Is he actually doing good? Yeah, he's doing pretty good. My paladin, I don't know if he could handle that. Maybe. He doesn't have his, his gear isn't as good, I don't think. But the caster stopped shooting him, so... Maybe the caster was still on him. Be a little bit more of a challenge. Oh. Yeah, Mind Freeze looks awesome. Oh, there's Fell Reaver. We gotta get a photo of Fell Reaver coming towards us. I mean, if we don't hurry up, he's gonna kill us. There we go. Oh, we're in trouble. Should mount up. Alright, so we'll head back. We'll slay a couple of these uh, bone cheaper orcs on our way back. And it's pretty much the same quest. Like, I've never done the Alliance side. In uh, Outland, and pretty much do the same quest as you would do if you were a horde. go. Got a bunch of quests that are complete. Go turn these bad boys in. One thing we haven't used is a dungeon tool. It'll be fun to do a little bit of ramparts. We don't have any quests yet for it. I think I'll probably wait until we pick up a couple. Or at least one. Maybe we'll unlock it after doing a couple you of got these. My attention. Were you able to find any usable materials out there underneath all the dust, ash, and char? This is in better condition than I thought it would be. Sure, it's going to take some time to work off all the rust and char and the like. But I'll not complain. Alright, so we got some new legs. 
put those bad boys on. Now that we've gotten our salvage operation off the ground, it's time to, to begin the second phase of the plan. Across the path of glory, the Horde still has their old blade towers trained on us. Don't let their age fool you, Drab Box. They are still very dangerous. Much as we're working to reclaim what we can, we can't assume the Horde is going to dismantle their weaponry. Take this torch and burn the remaining siege equipment. I'll take no chan chances with honor hold safety. Watch, get her back. All right. Need help? Very good. I'm sure their losses will be felt in Hellfire Citadel. Although the dark bastion looms over us and seems nigh insurmountable, it is only the blood moves, the bold moves like you have made, that we will find victory over the fellow works. All right. So, what do you think's worth the most? Probably one of these shields. I guess I'll take the shield. Crabbox in our battles with the Bleeding Hollow Clan of Fell Orcs, we have found them foreboding trinkets. These orcs have collected the insignias of the fallen honor hold soldiers and created cursed talismans from them. We fear the dark magic of the Bleeding Hollow Orcs have transformed our insignias into evil charms with powers against us. Find such a talisman from a Bleeding Hollow Orc of Zeth Gore to the east and bring it to Corporal Iron Ridge at Expedition Point northeast of Zeth Gore. Alright, so we gotta set some stuff on fire and then we'll probably make our way down here. And we'll start uh, attacking Zeth Gore. We gotta burn some towers down. Nope, got some orcs down here. You can get by them. As long as we don't get charged. Alright, so we just burn these, these catapults. Yeah, that's it. Nope. That's one, the western one. See if this one counts. What happened there? Okay, where's the, the flame? There it is. Damn, he interrupted us. Let's huck this on our bars. Okay, so that doesn't count. So we have to keep going to each one. Probably this one, then this one. And then that tower, maybe. We're getting chased down here. Got a pig on us. Got one more. This guy's casting us. Let's grip him. There we go. Alright, so one more tower to go. Oh man, we missed one in the back.
I wonder where that one was. I swear we shot two. This is where Questy helps out a lot. So I'd be totally lost right now. Does this one count? No, it just shoots that one. What the heck? Oh, crip that guy. Didn't interrupt him though. It's too bad. Let's try again. Yeah, I might be wrong. There we go. Alright, so we're done with the towers. I guess we'll go around. We'll turn in the quest. Maybe we can get another one from them. And then we'll head down to Zethgor. Yeah, there's got to be some level 70 DKs out there by now. Cool to see how they are in raid. Do they do a lot of damage? They're gonna do a lot of damage in Wrath, supposedly. Heard of Nax are like really good. We're looking for this dwarf. I don't know where the heck he went. Everyone's dead in here. What the heck? There's Dumfrey laying on the ground. Oh, somebody killed them all. <laughs> There's a horde guy who came and killed them all. What the heck? That's hilarious. That's some serious grief. What level are they? 60? Yeah, it's probably easy for them. Yeah, they're all dead. And this DK. Savages. Alright, so we'll move on. We'll come back later and turn it in. It's too bad that he died like that. That's why I kind of like Robbio still. I know that's kind of lame. Some people consider it griefing, but... Those are like fun moments, especially if you can like defend it, like if a bunch of like alliance came and like wrecked the guy who was in there. Gotta watch over Fell Reaver. We're gonna head over here. I think this is like uh, another group that just hates the Burning Legion. Your battle prowess has been noted by High Command, Death Knight. They want to send you to the front lines to meet up with Rohamas's crew. They're radicals devoted to complete extermination of the Burning Legion, so you may fit right in. Head east about 400 paces across the Valley of Bones until you run into a destroyed Fell Reaver. See Expedition Point where a Legion base used to stand. Once there, you are to report to Forward Commander Kingston. Now move out. Imagine I come here and all the NPCs are dead. Oh, the Alliance barely have a fort here. It's kind of brutal. Get him. Alright, let's turn it in this quest. You got my attention. This guy looks pretty cool. Hi. Expedition Point is the Alliance's closest point 
have contact with the Legion Front. North of here is nothing but demon. Demon and more demon. Travel with a buddy. Glad to meet you, soldier. Enough chatting. Now listen up. I have a vital mission for you, and I want you to succeed and survive. To find the Legion Front to our northeast, and space along it are portals used to gather in reinforcements from throughout Outland. We trap box are going to destroy those portals. Take this primer designed in Area 52. It uses the demon's own power as an explosive device. Defeat Legion forces around portals Grim and Kalez to gather demonic ruin stones. Use the primer to detonate the stones inside the portals, then watch the fireworks. Go Travadin and return to me when your mission is complete. Off with you. Light be with you. Move along unless you've got business with the fleet. It's time to strike Zethgor from the air. Our Griffin Riders are ready for a sortie, Strap Box. But they need someone on the ground to direct their fire. Are you ready for a covert mission? Take these smoke beacons into Zethgor, the Bleeding Hollow Stronghold to the west. They have four guard towers, one near the northern wall, one near their southern wall, one near their forge, and another nestled in their foothills. Place a beacon underneath each of the towers and we'll fly and bomb them. Alright, we might get a new chest from this. Eh, probably not. Be careful. Didn't have any plate. Alright, so what should we do first? I guess we'll do, uh... We'll do the beacons. And we'll blow these bad boys up. We gotta fight these, uh... Fight her first. I need four to blow it up, I believe. Right? Yeah, we need four. So how many do we have now? Three? I've been getting one off every single one. It's pretty lucky. And it's the exact same story. Like, the, the Horde have radicals as well. On the other side. <laughs> that hate the Burning Legion. Like, you go to Zethkor as well. That's the Horde. I assume the Zethkor quest will be a little different, though. Like, as the Horde, you just burn them, I guess. As a lion's, you know, they put beacons down. You're supposed to bomb it. How many portals have we disrupted? Okay, Grim's right over there. I'll admit, I kind of like the Horde side a little bit more at the moment. I think Thralmar... It's just, I don't know, it seems like, I don't know, I, kinda, I just like the way it looks more than Honor Hold. We'll see, we could see some changes as we quest. Okay, we got three. We need one more. Maybe at least two will have it. Uh. 
right, so there we go. So we'll turn this in. We'll see if he gives us any more quests to fight the Bleeding Hollow works. What's on your mind? Exhibition point? Yeah, we read that. I wish I could be there to watch the fire display. Those explosives pack a big punch. Well done, Trap Pox. Disabling those portals will stem the flow of Legion reinforcements for a long time. We can't rest yet. Alright, so this is... Might be better. I don't know. He had more stamina and armor, but I think the damage is a little less. And then there's... We'll just take it anyways. Good for tanking. Mission, the Merketh and Shadraz Gateways. Just west of the Dark Portal are two transporters, Gateway Merketh and Gateway Shadraz. If you look east of the Path of Glory, you'll see them on either side of the road. I want you to bomb them both into rubble. Here are the bombs you'll use, specially designed by a goblin in Area 52. Now speak with Wing Commander Dabbery. He'll put you on a Griffin and send you on your Watch way. Your back. Okay, so we're going to start... I'm going to do a little bombing mission here. Here's the bombs. This will uh, make it Eve for now. Can I help you? So there's that Griffin guy. Got any junk to sell? Yeah. Keep the food. Shield we can get rid of. Farewell. Oh, Dabra, there he is. I'm on a bonding mission for forward Commander Kingston. I need a Griffin destroyer. Alright, so let's try to do this one shot. That's the goal. Most of the times when I do this... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oops. Yeah, I don't do it one shot. Actually, this one's pretty easy. There's another one where you go somewhere else. Is that the other one? Murketh right over there? Yeah, this one's actually the easy one. I was thinking we were going to do another one. You just have to bomb two of these. Not too bad. And that's it. It's good that they gave people a month to level up DKs so that they could be, you know, somewhat on par with other classes. This is a vital mission, Trap Box. It's one I would not trust to anyone. To just anyone. <laughs> that will slow them down. There's no denying it. I think you just put me in a uncharacteristically good mood, Trap Box. Okay, so we got this plate chest. I think this one might be better. Yeah. So I'll put that on. Shatter point. Trapbox, you've done a great job here at the front, and you showed a lot of talent with that armored griffin. I think I have another mission to mind you. This new mission launches from Shatter Point, an attack base 
the wild hammers set up on a floating piece of land near the portal. It's a little unnerving there, but you have guts. You'll be fine. Talk to Wing Commander Debris and have him send you to Shatter Point. From there, report to Griffin Master Runetog Wildhammer. Safe travels. Well met. All right, let's go to uh, Shatter Point. Light bless you. I wonder where that is. Oh, all the way up there. That's kind of interesting. So yeah, we're going to go on a couple of uh, bombing missions here. I never knew that this was like an alliance fort that the Wildhammer clan controlled. The Wildhammers are uh, one of the three Dwarven clans. I don't know if you guys know who Falstad is from Heroes of the Storm, but he's a Wildhammer Dwarf. There it is, right there. Never even knew this existed. Be a cool spot to duel. Okay, so we'll go up here. Well, actually, we'll turn in the quest first. Who we gotta speak with? There he is. Great to meet you. Shatter Point is a great place for a wild hammer dwarf. I've never had so much time in the air. Aha, a fresh human from the mainland. Well, don't worry. Shatter Point might make you queasy, but she doesn't stray far. And I've only seen her flip upside down once or twice. Wing Commander Griffengar. Wing Commander Griffengar runs his outfit of wild hammers. If this is your first time in Shatter Point, then you should report to him. You'll find him inside of what's left of that tower over yonder. Good. Well, let's go see him. What can I do for you? You're feeling queasy? Speak with Pestle. You might have something for your motion sickness. Spoke to Runetog? A fine dwarf he is. Keeps his griffins in good shape and battle ready. I am Griffengar, commander here. At Shatter Point. I know it's not pretty, but this hunk of rock is a vital staging point for sorties into Hellfire. You'll see Griffins flying out and in and in non-stop. Advice, here's some. Keep your gear stowed, your stomach empty, and your eye on the horizon. Shatter Point starts to teeter. Then grab onto something that won't float away. Okay. I wonder what shorties are or sorties. I guess that's what they call the. See you soon. They call the demons. Great to meet you. All right, the official shelf. Now that you've got your wings, perhaps you'd be interested in running another bombing mission. This time, we've isolated the Legion's main production area behind the forge camp to the north. I need you to get on a Griffin and destroy the whole damn thing. Here are your bombs. Now talk to Griffin here, Windbellow. When you're ready to take off. Watch your back. Alright, so this is the mission I usually fail. The first time. And we have to go again. There's a wind bell. He's right around here, right? It's Rune Talk Wildhammer. How are you? Keep your feet on the ground. Where's this wind bellow guy? Is that him? What can oh, I do for you? Shatterpoint is a great place for a wild hammer dwarf. I've never had so much time in the air. This is all say the same. All right, send me to uh, the abyssal shelf. Safe travels. All right, here we go. And we have to bomb. The peons are easy. It's these uh, org overseers that are the biggest pain. We got to make sure we bomb them. Should be moving in now. Bomb this first thing here. We're gonna bomb this guy next. Bomb these, to try to bomb these two. 
We've got two Ganarga Overseers bomb this guy. Three. Come on. Alright, so we're doing pretty good so far. So we'll bomb that for now. Then after this it should just be peons. But yeah, I, every time I do this, I always just focus on the peons too much. And then you just run out of Ganarks. You just got you know, the Overseer ones. There we go, we're done. And it's cool that they brought it over here. Because it would be such a pain if they did it here and you had to fly all the way over. And then all the way back. And then if you failed, that would be so crap. <laughs> Flying from over here up to here. Because the Horde have it here. They got a little like, air camp there. Alright, so we're flying in. I wonder how this thing, like, floats. And they were so, like, confident in it that they built a, a fort here. And then somehow, like, I don't know, this thing got torn apart and now it's just floating in the air. How are ya? Show them that not even the skies are safe. You fly as if you've been doing it your entire life, Trapbox. Outstanding. Performance out there. Not even a scratch on the Griffin Destroyers. Okay, so we got some play legs. Bunch of junk. We'll just take the blade. Sell it. Alright, go to the front. Well, Trapbox, I hope you're prepared for the next phase of our operation. The Legion never rests. And neither shall we. Take a griffin and fly over to Honor Point. It's a small post near the Legion front. Speak with Field Marshal Brock. He'll have instructions for you when you arrive. Oh, and tell that pasty faced shield kisser. I said hello. <laughs> Safe travels. All right. Okay, this is return to the Abyssal Shelf. Hello. We're not going to do you that. Soon. You don't get XP for it. Like, I tried it as on a, as a horde. And it's pretty much just like a daily you can do for fun. Like, I don't know. Yeah, I didn't get any XP for it for some reason. So where are we heading now? We're going over here. Okay. So we're going to start attacking these, uh, these bases over here. What can I do for you? Well met, Death Knight. I'm glad that crusty old dwarf finally saw fit to send us some elf. So is this guy a Death Knight too? It looks like it. Oh no, he's not really. He's not a Death Knight. He's just wearing Nax gear. Pay close attention, Trap Box. We've been surveying the Legion camps that lie along the ridge ahead. We have reason to believe that these so-called forge camps are where the demons are constructing those blasted fell reavers. You can see the closest target, Forge Camp Megadon. To the west, our intelligence suggests that's still under construction. If you can slay the Ganarg servants and their master, Razorsaw, we can bring the Legion's fell reavers production to a grinding halt. For the Alliance. Okay, so let's go do that. And we have to uh, slay a bunch of Ganarks. And then there's Razor Saw right there. And we gotta get rid of these bombs. Oh damn, we gotta suck it this on us. Let's pull this guy. Well, we could death grip him. Uh. 
I'm just gonna pull a bunch of these guys. These guys remind me of like the little minions from Halo. It's like little aliens that shoot at you. I care what they're called. And that's what they look like to me. I had so much trouble here on my paladin as a prod paladin. It was brutal. <laughs> and now we're just wrecking these guys as it's DK. Makes me wonder if my ret would be doing damage like this. I doubt it. I think DKs are just kind of overpowered. I don't think my paladin was doing thousand plus crits. Well, we gotta came on attacking us. Alright, so let's, uh... So we can have a bite of food here. Just took out the food from the prologue. I know what's better, eating this food? Or the heavy rune cloth bandage. Yeah, the food seems a lot faster. You're a rogue around here. Yeah, dwarf rogue. I wonder if any have spawned over here. Doesn't look like it. Alright, so we'll make our way to the next point. Might be some servants over there. We only need five more. Problem is getting in there is a pain. one. It's an easy target. You're probably better off just staying here and waiting for another pack to spawn. Cannons pack a punch, though. I think we'll be okay. Well, 
Let's have another one of those mushrooms. There's one right over there. And after that, we just need one more. Grip this guy. Oh, we did. Huh? Let me pull this one. Get rid of the cannon first. Does way more damage. Well, there's a cause coming for revenge. Let's see if we can beat him again. We have a lot of room power. Yeah, DKs are insane. Yeah, we have a talent too. A lot of talent. We got 60 last episode from the BG. So I guess we'll go. We'll max out Guile and Gorfine. Increases our critical strike damage bonus of our Blood Strike, Frost Strike, and Howling Blast. And obliterate abilities by 45%. Increases the duration of your Icebound Fortitude by 6 seconds. Do we have Icebound Fortitude? I don't think so. No, yeah, it's like a defensive cooldown, right? Greetings. Well, I must say I am impressed, Rab Box. I didn't think you had the medal for this mission. Well done. Well done indeed. Now we focus on the second target, Forge Camp Rage. It lies just west of Megadon. Trouble is, the demons have a number of fell cannons armed straight at the Horde's outpost of Thralmar. Though I can scarcely believe it, we actually need the Horde to help us hold the line at the Dark Portal. We can't afford to let Thralmar fall. You've got to destroy those cannons before the Legion pulverizes our allies. Go with honor. Alright, so let's go get rid of those cannons. Yeah, so they're trying to help the Horde. That's good. This guy's gonna go fix that cannon. I'll just go attack this one here. Okay, we'll go to this one. Let's see if we pull everything. Yeah, they're all coming. I didn't think they'd come. Might be in trouble. Yeah, we're in trouble. We might actually die. We're dead. It's gonna be our first death on the DK. <laughs> rough. That was rough. Got a little greedy there. Should have ate some food. Did you get the cannon though? Yeah, we got one cannon down, so that's good. We need icebound fortitude. Could have jumped off, but I wasn't going to fall to my death. Okay, we'll res here and fight this thing. We're just in a pretty rough spot. Alright, so let's have a bite to eat here. And then we got one more cannon to go. We can outrange it. Doesn't look like it. Oh, 
the heck, we got another one of those. We might die again. Where'd this third one come from? I can't outrage. Not great, it's getting rough. Might be in trouble here. Maybe I should put down like death and decay. Can I strangulate this guy? If it does anything? He might be dead here. Oh, she's whipping us. She's whipping our ass. Come on, get her. Oh man, that was close. Okay, let's eat here. That was really close. Yeah, I should use Death and Decay there. Just 26 shadow damage every second to the targets that are in the area. I should use more uh, Blood Boil. I wasn't Blood Boiling enough. All right, here we go, the final cannon. All right, so I'll turn this in. And hopefully after we finish all these, we can pick up a quest for, uh... Hellfire Citadel. I mean, Hellfire Exhaust Ramparts. I have to hand it to you, Trapbox. You're a fighter born. Those horde yokels may never know how close they came to the end. It takes real characters to step in harm's way on behalf of your enemies. That's the kind of honor and commitment that holds the Alliance together. Field Marshal Block salutes you crisply. Invasion Point Annihilator. Well, we located the Legion's final base on the ridge, Invasion Point Annihilator. It lies northwest of Forge Camp Ridge, and it houses a warp portal through which the Legion has been drawing its reinforcements. We've got to close that portal to prevent any demons from coming through. The portal the points overlord of Warbringer Arixamal holds the portal's activation key. Take it from him and shut that blasted gateway Light down. Alright, so we'll finish this off. By taking down this portal. It could be a pain. Maybe we'll we'll try to run by these guys, but it might be tough. Might have to fight this guy. Somehow, no, he's running after us. Come and we'll just fight him. I make this shift one. Oh, another DK on the ground there. His name's Nyquil. <laughs> okay, so the portal be just around here. Is that the right spot? I think it's a little further. up here. Should probably get a couple of bandages just in case. Mm, 
Okay, we'll heal up quick here. I'm try to sneak through. Probably pull this guy. There's a Rixamol right there. Let's grip him in. Pull this uh, servant as well. There we go. So let's use a little bit of death and decay. Let's see how this works. It's working pretty damn well. Glitching out for a second. We got a hidden necklace. I think that's a quest, isn't it? No. This is attack power 23. Nah, not that great. Yeah, you get really good gear from the DK prologue. It's like comparable to raid gear. From like Nax. Oh, we missed. I'll freeze him here. I like that. We've got somebody else on us now. There we go, we got the key and we got a letter. Alright, so let's blow this up. That's all we needed, right? We got the key? We have to open the letter? Extinguish this. I'll open this letter quick. Text on the note is written in some dark, insiderable scrawl. The more you stare at them, the more the symbols seem to twist and burn before your eyes. There is only one at honor hold who can decipher such archaic script, the Draenei Mystic Creeve. Take the Burning Legion missive to Warp Scryer Creeve, who resides within the War Room at honor hold. Okay, so now we, now we can do it. Okay. Guess we had to read the letter. All right, so there we go. We're done there. There's another quest over here. Outland sucks. Could, <laughs> could go down there and do that, but I don't know. We'll, we'll probably head back. We'll just head back. This episode's been over an hour. Yeah, it's a cool thing about Questy. You just, you know, go on a quest rampage. You always have a quest that... It's on your map that you can see. But the way I was doing it before, I would just have like a couple of quests lined up. I'd do that and that would be uh, the episode. Or maybe I would do like a quest chain like this. Right, so let's turn this in. I think we got something nice here, maybe. Need help? You close down that war portal yet, trap box? While you're here shuffling your feet, there are more demons entering that land. Great job. That should drastically cut down on the number of demons trying to creep up our backsides. I can't thank you enough for your help here, trap box. Be careful. All right, so there we go, guys. I guess we're done here. Take a picture of this guy.
Got an orc? He already has a mount, what the heck? This guy's already flying. It's a level 70 Death Knight, guys. Wow. That's crazy. So yeah, that's crazy. People level hard. Hasn't even been a week. Hasn't even been three days. Yeah, congrats to him. Alright, guys. Well, I guess we will call the episode here. Next episode, I guess we'll head over to Zethkor and we'll turn in these few quests. And we'll try to uh, clean up all the quests around Honorhold. But as always, thanks for watching. Keep your heads up. Later. Later.